Hi, friends. It has been a minute, hasn't it? Well, I have been gallivanting to parts of the East Coast. Um, I had my annual vacation. I went back home, saw my dad, uh, spent an entire month hanging out with family and just generally having a good time. I'm back home and boy, do I got stuff. Um, I've got some decks, so there'll be some walkthroughs coming. Um, I Yesterday, um, I did a live with our lovely Becca over at uh, Becca's Home and Tarot. And that was so much fun talking about Kickstarters and then also talking about my musical family and my aunts and uh, all of that business. So I will link that down below so you can watch the replay. That was a lot of fun. Um, I always love hanging out with Becca. She's so easy to talk to. Um, yeah, so that's what I've been up to. I've been home for about two weeks now getting reacclimated to, um, you know, my own schedule and stuff. And summer's here. I'm so excited. Summer's here, which is perfect pool and beach weather and uh, cleaning off the mermaid patio and just uh, getting outside again. And I'm really excited for that. Um, what else? Oh, yeah, yeah. It is the beginning of July, so this is when they start putting out the Halloween stuff. Yay! So I have my eyes peeled. Um, I've been in several stores looking for uh, the Halloween items, but from what I can see, most items are going to start dropping around the 15th of uh, July. So I'm keeping my keeping my sights ready for all the cool Halloween stuff. And um, I hope they do have cool Halloween stuff. I have to say, last year I was a bit disappointed because they, they didn't have, um, they really didn't have anything that blew my socks off. So I'm hoping that we're now a couple of years removed from the pandemic that maybe the spirit of Halloween will uh, be reignited and uh, folks get the, get the bug, get the Halloween bug. Um, yeah, so I wanted to kind of give a little update as to uh, what's been happening in my life because I haven't done any videos for over a month. And so I've got that going on. Also, this is going to be kind of an update on my journaling process. So I've had a couple people, Tony, uh, ask me <laughs> about my journaling because um, it's been a year uh, since I started, at least a year. And um, I was not a good journaler. So as studying the Zen, my teacher required me to keep a Zen journal. And I'm not a journaler. I never have been. I've got lovely books and journals, but I rarely use them. Um, but this time I, I tried to do something. And um, so I went out on the interwebs and I am going to give a, a shout out to... Um, Antoinette Intuitive and Tarot because it was her journaling videos that kind of sparked me uh, into action. And so shout out to Tony. She also turned me on to a company that makes leather journals and they're beautiful handmade journals. Uh, so this is my journal. This is the very first one I got. I love the colors because it's, I mean, it's me. It's purple and it's green and yellow and pink and orange. And of course we have the, the moon here. And 
you know, it's got little stars on it. This was handmade, hand colored. Now, this is uh, uh, my pen loop. Let me do this. So this, this is a pen loop that I bought on Amazon. It only comes in this yellow color, but it, it fits over the, just over the front cover for, for my pen. But when you open it up, it's got um, lovely pockets on both ends. Whoop. And this is big enough that it, it's got actually eight, eight strings uh, in the middle, eight strings in the middle. So you could, um, it's, it's chunky and you could put quite a bit uh, in there, which I wanted because at the time, well, still, I'm reading a lot of Zen books and there are daily things I do plus my journal and then there's some witchy things I've got in there and note pages. So um, it's perfect. This is an A5 extra wide. A5 extra wide. So what I have here is I have, I have my journal and then I have my which is Almanac, which is something that I use on the daily. Um, and then uh, right now I've just got a couple of uh, extra notepads for, for scratching and stuff and other things. So that's what I have in, in this one. Um, I did have another book in here, but the book size was a little awkward. Um, so I kind of took it out. But yes, Antoinette got me journaling. Now my journal is nothing like hers. Hers is really pretty. Mine is pretty basic. I just write stuff in it. I did manage to find a company that made these um, stick in uh, calendars, which I love. And it's got, um, I put my doctor's appointments in it and stuff, but my stickers, I give myself a sticker for when I do my meditation. If I, if I do my, medita my daily meditation, I get a sticker. That's kind of like a good for you, you know. It, it's good motivation. It's good motivation. And the company that makes these great journals is called El Roher. El Roher. And I will... You know, I will link all of my stuff and things um, in Antoinette's channel in the description box below um, if you want to know more because uh, this thing is, is beautiful and I love it. And sometimes the company has sales on their Facebook page because it's like you can get them a little cheaper because they're scratch and dent. Um, they do have a Etsy page, which I will link. That's how I got this one was through their Etsy page. And then when I ended up liking their Facebook page, I noticed that they would occasionally have uh, sales on the Facebook page when they were like trying something out and they didn't like it as well or if the leather didn't perform well. Now, I, I just, yes, I had to get another one. So <laughs> I just got this one just before I went on vacation. But I mean, isn't it gorgeous? Um, and I decided to put in, this is the, the daily book I'm studying right now. So I took it out of the other one and I just gave it its own little home here. And of course we have the, we have the pockets. And the only thing that's wrong with this one is, see the leather is just split a little bit more in the back here it's not it's not perfect um and so it was discounted uh gorgeous absolutely gorgeous you guys and these are so well made um i'll have these for years and years and years uh, all different patterns and colors and i'm just amazed at uh, what this company can do. They also take custom orders as well. 
uh, somebody had an absolutely beautiful hobbit door made, uh, you know, a hobbit door on the, on the front here. So, yeah. Anyways, I'm loving the journal stuff. It has helped me because all of my items are in one place. I can pick this up every morning and do what I need to do. And I'm not reaching for books all over the place, which is what I was doing beforehand. So, yeah. Um, I still struggle to journal. Uh, I don't journal on a daily basis. Um, but I do the best I can with it. And that's all I can do. Uh, yeah. So there's my journaling update. Finally like a year and a half after or over a year later, my journaling update. I'm still journaling because of this. I'm doing better at it than I was before. Um, but I'm still not a daily terrific journaler. We're still working on it. <laughs> anyway, my friends, this is my first update to all things after... Uh, I have returned from vacation and we're getting ready to go into summer and stay tuned because I have got like three decks to walk through here. So, or maybe four, I don't know. <laughs> I've got so many <laughs> and they're still coming in. Uh, yeah. So I hope you all have a fantastic weekend and I will see you on the next one.